the project itself is a, is a multi-phase project. There's two existing buildings on the site. Those two buildings were uh, built by CN Rail at the beginning of the century. And so those two buildings took, took the students for the first couple of years. And while they were there learning, uh, we built this two new wings. And the first wing, this wing here, is the library and uh, lecture hall. And it's built out of this unique material called CLT, cross-laminated timber. And that's these, these big slabs of wood here. This is the first um, significant use of CLT in Ontario. And it's nice that it's, it's actually a school of architecture that it, it's, it's uh, being used on. The building itself can be a teaching tool for the students. So they can now uh, see the innovative use of materials and apply it to their own design. Wood here as CLT is quite new, but wood buildings have hundreds of year old traditions, right? From farmhouses in France to Quebec, it's called Carré de Bois, solid wood planks that made up walls. So the wood technology that is always in schools of architecture curriculums, we really want to take that and foreground it, much in the same way the building does, with focusing on wood and wood design. And now we're going to embark on digital wood and start looking at digital uses of technologies, which is again innovative in technology with uh, student projects. So an artifact like the canoe or an old wooden building, they're the precedents for thinking about this new future use of wood, which is innovative and at the same time resonates with the local cultures and of course the timber industry.